I am Adil Kumar. Welcome to my series on counting principles. We have two related questions here. The first one is how many four digit numbers will have sum of all the digits as three? List all the numbers. The second question here is use your concept to find the total number of five digit numbers that will have sum of all its digits as three. So the only difference between the first and the second question is that we are considering four digit numbers first and then we'll extend our knowledge to five digit numbers, right? So let us see how to find four digit numbers with sum of digits as 3. Right? So let's do first part. Now if we want sum of 3, what could be the combinations? We are looking for 4 digit number and we want sum of 3. Well, one possibility is that we could have 3 in the beginning, right? And in that case, all other numbers will be zeros. Since we need four digit number, we cannot start with zero, right? So that could be one combination, right? The other combination could be that we could start with two, right? Now, if I start with two, then to make a sum of three, we could have two and one combination, correct? So starting with two, we could have one, zero, zero, that could be one combination. Now this position of one could be either of these three places, right? So it could be two, zero, one, zero, or two, zero, zero, one, right? So starting with two and combining it with one, we do get sum as 3, right? So these are all possible combinations. Well, in this particular case, we could also have starting with 1, right? And 2 as the other number. Now, in that case, what could be the combinations? If I start with 1, I could place 2 in either of these three places, correct? So if I start with 1, I could place 2 in the second place, third place, or fourth place, correct? So again, I get these three combinations. So well, that gives us seven ways. Now, another way could be that we could have three ones, right? So, so one way is to have combination of three with zeros. The other way is to have combination of twos and ones. And the last way could be that we could have three ones, right? So that also will give us sum of three, right? So, so we could have combination like this. One, so placing one in the first place, second place, third place, and then a zero, right? Or what we could do here is that we could keep one in, in the first two places and then shift this zero to the next place. So it is zero with three ones or we could place zero in the second place well we cannot place zero in the first place since then it will be only a three digit number clear so that gives you different types of combinations right so so counting them we get one two three four five six seven eight nine ten ways of getting four digit numbers with sum of all digits as three, right? So we get 10 ways. And we have listed all the 10 combinations here. Now let's try to answer the second part of it, right? So we have already done the first part. The second part now is use your concept to find total number of five digit numbers that will have sum of all its digits as 3, right? So the same thing, 
but this time we have to extend it for five digit numbers correct now let us see how to figure this out so we'll take it on a fresh page here is the modified second question with multiple choices for you use your concept to find the total number of five digit numbers that will have sum of all its digits as three and you are given four options you can pause the video answer this question and then look into my suggestions right so as we did in the last time we know that there are three four different ways right so one way of course for five numbers is that when we could have these five positions filled with three in the first position and the other numbers being zero right so so one two three four and five so that is one way well the other ways are we could start with two right so so we again have five positions one two three four and five and we can start with two now if i start with two i can place one in either one of these four positions right so basically i have one way to go with three and starting with two combining two with one we could actually have four numbers correct because i could put one here there or in these two places so there are four possible places where i can place one for example like this right so one zero 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 second time i'll put one here third time there and then fourth right others will be zero so that gives me four different ways now flipping one and two right so we could also begin with one and then use two as our second number correct so if i begin with one and place two we could place it here that gives one position two position three positions four positions so we get four different ways in which we could have one followed by two right. now let's come to the tricky part and that is we need sum of three so we could have even three ones right so in these five positions we could place three ones so now let us explore what will happen if i have these three ones placed in five positions that is the whole thing correct of course we cannot begin with zero so that means we have to put one in the first place right so that is fixed now we are left with two ones to be placed in four places now these two ones are similar so if i place for example one and one or if i place this one first and the other one later i see that the numbers are exactly same do you see that so there are duplication of the numbers perfect now a shortcut method is that if I fix this position and now I have four more positions one two three and four the possibility of placing a one is in four places right so we have four places to fill in the first one for once we fix that for the second one we have three places right so four times three so there are 12 places in all out of which there are going to be duplications right as we have seen since we have two identical objects we call them so we need to divide this by two to get the real number of combinations which are unique numbers so that gives us six combinations do you see that and now we can write down our answer so the total combinations are how many one plus four plus four plus six right so we have six plus four ten plus four fourteen and one fifteen so we have 15 combinations when we have five digits and the sum of the number of these digits is three perfect so that is how you can solve this question i hope you find it interesting and useful feel free to write your comment share your views and if you like and subscribe to my videos that'd be great thanks for your time and all the best